Baby girl said that she wanna take my wife. Baby girl said that she loved me for life. But just like Sprite, it fizzled out and it died. Cause now I don't see her and all I do is cry. All she did to my heart was break it and lie. I don't know why she f***ing with that dude up on the side. She needed up my feelings like they're some kind of frost. Let me... Calm the hell down. Oh, what is up, you guys? Hope y'all been partying like every day is your birthday. Because we got another one for y'all today, and we have a special video. Before we get into that, though, I am going to say, man, shout out to Kanjik. You know, his channel link and this video, original video link shit, will be in the description. So shout out to him for letting me react to this. You know, I DM'd him. He said it was all good. You know, just throw the link down in the channel in the description. And, uh, you know, we always do that anyway. So I hope you guys do enjoy that. That. Make sure to go show him some love. But we got Funimation and Crunchy Roller ending officially new. F or, huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> Funimation and Crunchy Roll ending officially for new service. Yo, as a Funimation person, you know, first off, they better give me a damn refund if they doing that shit. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I've really not heard any news about this. So I definitely do want to check this out and uh see what we're working with uh if you guys have any information let me know in the description you know maybe there will actually what the hell am i even talking about let's just shut the hell up and watch this shit because it's probably gonna tell us anyway Ooh. the hell is going on right now so it's done it took was, a while, but it's done. Was that his intro? And I'm not sure why people are surprised because, I mean, there really was nothing stopping this. It was announced that Sony would be buying Crunch. I thought he was saying, you know, it's done like that was his new intro or something. Bro, that shit was fire, man. That shit was fire. I'm not going to cap. I, that was pretty clean. She rolled from AT&T making Warner Brothers give up the service so Sony could put their company Funimation in charge of their main competitor. And I mean, main competitor, like seriously. Wait a minute, I'm not gonna cap, bro. I kind of zoned out. I need to hear that shit again. <laughs> announced that Sony would be buying Crunchyroll from AT&T, making Warner Brothers- AT&T owned Crunchyroll? So Sony could put their company Funimation in charge of their main competitor. And I mean, main competitor, like seriously. No one else really compares. I mean, Anime Lab was getting there, but Funimation has control of that. Uh, Funimation, man. But that was announced quite some time ago, and if Disney was allowed to purchase Fox, it was just so obvious that Monopoly Laws wouldn't stop Sony from getting Crunchyroll. Now, Sony originally announced that they would put Funimation's higher-ups in control of really the fate of Crunchyroll after Sony owned it. And now they do. So Funimation tweeted yesterday saying, Yay for anime. Funimation. Yo, let's go, bro. You know, I my hands still messed up. I don't know if y'all can see that shit. So I'm not going to clap really hard. But shout out. Y'all, this is what we need. And you know why this is so good? Because now, this is what the fluff... Yo, Xbox, Sony, grow some cojones and get together, man. Because this is what we need on that platform, bro. Instead of trying to compete with each other and get the best platform, if they came together, bro, they could revolutionize gaming. Revolutionize anime, you know what I'm saying? Maybe not revolutionize anime, but they can... I, I don't really know what Funimation and Crunchy will do, but I know they at least dub stuff. So they can now work on that and get that better together, you know. I'm sure there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes that I don't know that now they can just come together and instead of competing, bro, just work on making the best app possible for the viewers and everybody. So you got to love seeing people do this and just, you know, do it together. I always say, man, you want to go, you want to go, you know, ahead in life do it yourself but you want to go far do it with others i promise y'all that's definitely the best way to go and crunchyroll are one company today now we can start the crazy fun working of bringing our worlds together now i'm going to let you know as far as we know right now what this actually means there's a lot of people saying things that are just not true about this first i've seen people saying how this is a good thing because now older anime on crunchyroll will get dubs 
But uh, no, that's not something that is likely to happen. Come on now, Old it's not gonna happen. That has no dub will most likely remain with no dub. Funimation didn't get Crunchyroll simply to dub old anime. I doubt that's even an idea in their heads right now. Unless an old anime on there would be cool though. Has many new viewers and is then deemed more profitable to bring in traffic, then maybe. Plus, Crunchyroll owns licensing rights to be able to have all of those anime on their platform. That's different from dubbing rights. Funimation can't get dubbing rights for an anime on Crunchyroll by buying Crunchyroll if Crunchyroll doesn't even have the dubbing rights. I'm going to read- Holy shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to cap. This dude's doing a really jo a good job explaining this, you know, but, you know, I just wasn't ready to be taking a class right now. So I'm going to have to really tighten up and focus, but- Yo, I didn't know that. I didn't know that the dub and subbed rights are totally different thing, bro. But I mean, that does make sense. You know, the people who do uh, subs probably live in Japanese and, you know, dub maybe probably live or, you know, I don't know. They probably live in different areas, though. And, you know, they are totally different. Well, now that I think about it, like, bro, every time the sub and the dub usually are totally different, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to the voice actors and how they portray emotions and stuff like that. So I definitely now see the light, you know? I definitely now see the truth. Do a part of the press release for this whole thing that gives us basically insight into what the plans are and then explain to you what this most likely really means going forward. Crunchyroll adds tremendous value to Sony's existing anime business, including Funimation and our traffic partners at Aniplex and Sony Damn, Music. Damn, Sony's Anime rich as hell, bro. Said Tony Vincent Guetta, chairman and CEO of Sony Pictures Entertainment Incorporated. With Crunchyroll and Funimation, we are committed to creating the ultimate anime experience for fans and presenting a unique opportunity for our key partners, publishers, and the immensely talented creators to gotta love to hear to it, man. deliver their masterful content to audiences around the world. With the addition of Crunchyroll, we have an unprecedented opportunity to serve anime fans like never before and deliver the anime experience across any platform they choose. Yes, From theatrical events let's get to it man games streaming linear tv everywhere and every way fans want to experience their anime our goal is to create a unified anime subscription experience as soon as possible bro that's yeah, so all you know what's one thing i would love to see them do you guys if at all possible i don't know about y'all bro but one thing i would love to to be able to do you know what i'm gonna give you a mother fluffing billion dollars idea you over there looking and I, I know you just you heard that shit and you're like damn bro them mother fluffers are rich they on sony and crunchyroll bro i would love to see one of y'all create i'm giving you the a million dollar idea so get your lazy ass up and do it and, unless it's not your passion you know if you're not passionate about it and you know it's not something you would enjoy making don't do it uh, you know it's not about the money it's about what you love in life but uh I've always wanted to watch anime with the homies, you know what I'm saying? But there's really no way to do that. I mean, yeah, you can go on Discord and then all go onto the same website, you know, but you got to do all that steps, bro. One of y'all should make somehow a website, bro, or, you know what I'm saying, Funimation Crunchyroll. If y'all see this, go for it, man. Just whoever gets to it first. Where we could all watch it together. Where you could have multiple people join up in a call, bro, and just all watch, you know, all the shits together and just... Oh, I would love to see it, you know, not even just anime, just movies and all kind of stuff just like that. You know, where streamers could go on and just throw on a movie and not have to delete the stream right after and stuff like that. Where we, you know, they could really just interact with viewers. That's, that's something I've always would have loved to see and be able to do. Because, you know, whenever I do my reaction streams or we watch shows... I have to delete the shit right after, you know? And I hate having to do that. So I would love to, that for there to be a platform like that or someone to add that to the platform. So, hey man, there you go. I just made you mother fluffing rich. You're welcome. That was a mouthful. And I'm not sure if you understood that, but in basic English, what has been suspected as a major possibility on the channel throughout this whole time. What the shit the is that? To be approved is actually happening sony is in the midst of planning to no longer have crunchyroll and funimation be their own apps or services that what? time is coming to an end the crunchyroll and funimation apps we know will soon no longer exist instead it looks like by the sound of this that we will have one crunchmation app 
Crunchimation? Now, what we don't know is what the name of this new app will be, or if Fun Crunch? simply keep the name Funimation for its app and just make Crunchyroll's name stop existing. We also don't know what will happen to the Crunchyroll app Verve, spelled V-R-V, which features several different services for anime on it, like High Dive. Funimation was once part Whoa. of it until Sony bought it, but now will Verve be the singular service, or will Funimation be added back, or will the new app that replaces the current two be added to Verve, or will Verve just stop? It's a lot of questions, right? A lot Those of questions. questions we don't have answers for. We also don't know what will happen to the Crunchyroll original anime and if Funimation cares to pay for original anime on their platform. Since they have never actually created their own anime, they may stop Crunchyroll from doing so in order to save money. But I want to thank you guys for watching today's video. Oh, I, I didn't know Crunchyroll creates their own anime? Y'all know I'm, I'm a Funimation type of G. I never knew that. If you guys have to like before you go. Make sure y'all go leave a like on that man's channel, though. Really, really good. First off, voiceover with the animes. You know, sometimes I was just zoning out and watching that shit and not focusing, bro. It was just fire. But really did a good job explaining it. Because I hate when people explain shit, but they don't explain it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and I know, I know that might sound weird, but go replay it and listen to it again. And I know you know what I'm saying. But hey, shout out to him. Make sure y'all go show him some love. Definitely big things coming to the anime world bro I, I can't wait to see honestly where this takes the anime community and uh, stuff like that and uh, just see where we get to go because it's just it's just something i got into you all know recently but something i really do enjoy i do think they have good shows it's just i don't know it's just new to me bro i just hated watching tv i felt like everything is just oh my god i don't know i just i don't know bro just some shits are so bad acting and you know some stuff is just not good and just a lot of problems but i feel like anime bro is just overall always pretty damn good and they just have so many different types and storylines you know literally probably any i'm hungry as shit i could probably there's anime that i could watch for food i, I you know I'm, I'm in a romantic mood i want to go watch some romantic anime you know um oh man i want to see someone get the motherfucking face face punched in let me go watch some violence you know you really have a wide range and just a good selection in every one and it's not just you know shit so i hope you guys did enjoy that man let me know what you guys think about this in the comments are y'all happy sad and uh why you know ex don't just explain it explain it you feel me i hope y'all have a good one and have a fantastic day deuces